as functional as its predecessor, as intelligent and customizable as never before. The estate not only continues the long model history of the classic E-Class, but also bridges the gap to the avant-garde trendsetters from Mercedes EQ with its new design. Balanced proportions are part of the appearance of a classic estate car. They are defined by the short front overhang, the long bonnet with power domes, the longer wheelbase and the balanced rear overhang. The Rothline is more dynamically designed compared to its predecessor, and at the same time the new E-Class estate scores again with functionality and load compartment volume. Combined with the raked rear window, the overall appearance is progressive. With its distinctive side profile, the estate clearly sets itself apart from the competition. The two character lines familiar from the saloon create a powerfully stretched car body and give the estate a sporty and stylish appearance. Sophisticated, three-dimensional and optimized down to the last detail, the surface finish exudes elegance. A black panel-like surface connects the radiator grille with the headlamps. This insert in high-gloss black is visually reminiscent of the Mercedes EQ models. The three-dimensionally designed radiator grille is either progressive or classic, depending on the equipment line. A chrome-framed radiator grille backlit by optical fibers is optionally available for all lines. The new E-Class Estate features LED high-performance headlamps as standard. As an optional extra, digital light is available without and with a projection function. All headlamp variants offer a distinctive day and night design. As a typical feature of the brand, the daytime running lights take the shape of an eyebrow. Precisely designed chrome elements as well as the progressively styled, two-part rear lamps characterize the rear end design. Thanks to its large opening, the load compartment can be used in a variety of ways. The design team has reinterpreted the rear lamps in terms of their contours and inner workings. With great depth of detail and partly animated functions, the interior design contributes to the vehicle's high-value appeal. The unique star motif makes the day and night design of the rear lamps unmistakable. The two light sections in the side wall and boot lid are visually connected. This further emphasizes the width of the rear. The reflectors have been relocated to the bumper. Because this allowed the load compartment opening to be particularly large, this increases the utility value on the one hand and makes the rear view look even wider on the other. The dashboard makes for the digital experience in the interior. If the E-Class Estate is equipped with the optional front passenger screen, the large glass surface of the MBUX Superscreen extends to the central display. Visually detached from this is the driver's display in the driver's field of vision. The front section of the instrument panel is illuminated by the light strip of the active ambient lighting. This runs in a wide arc from the windscreen, past the A-pillars and into the doors. This creates a generous feeling of space. An apparently free-floating control array in the upper section of the door panels matches the look of the glass surfaces of the screens. The center console is designed as a homogeneous unit and merges in a straight line into the lower section of the dashboard. At the front, a stowage compartment with lid and cup holders is integrated into the three-dimensionally shaped trim element. There is a soft padded armrest in the rear part of the center console. The contours of the seat surface and backrest flow elegantly from the inside to the outside and appear to float above the base of the seat thanks to their layer design. Indented vertical lines follow the outer contour, widening out towards the top. Compared to its predecessor, the E-Class Estate has increased in width by 28mm and the wheelbase has increased by 22mm. As a result, rear seat passengers enjoy more elbow room, knee and leg room. The load compartment can be expanded from 615 litres to up to 1830 litres. In the plug-in hybrid model, the luggage capacity is 460 to 1675 litres. The seat backrest can be split and folded down in a 40 to 20 to 40 ratio. The combustion engines are four and six cylinder units from the current modular Mercedes-Benz engine family fame. In addition to turbocharging, both the diesel and petrol engines feature intelligent support from an integrated starter generator. They are therefore mild hybrids. With the Mercedes E300 EA plug-in hybrid is also available at market launch already. With an electric output of 95 kilowatts or 129 horsepower and an all-electric range of up to over 100 kilometers, this model will on many days be on the road purely electrically, without the use of the petrol engine. 
More plug-in hybrids with diesel combustion engines will follow.